hi guys i'm about to be doing this tutorial on this look if you guys want to find out how i accomplished it just keep watching enjoy all right so i did really some really, uh so i did something really stupid i started recording i started doing my makeup but it wasn't even recording i was just staring at myself and talking to myself like an idiot <laughs> but what has happened is Put on primer with Elf's Tone Adjusting Face Primer. I color corrected. Oh, wait, also. I did, um, I also used the Pore Professional by Benefit. And, and I color corrected using LA Girls Pro Conceal. Blended that in. Also started my eyebrows. I used Benefit's brow valve conditioning primer and right now i'm in the middle of doing my eyebrows using anastasia beverly hills their brow pomade in the shade ebony yeah i'm just gonna act like that ain't happening i feel for you all right so Next, I'm going to conceal and fix and clean up my eyebrows using Ruby Kisses 3D Face Corrector. Creator? It's a face creator. That's weird. What do you mean face? How do you... How do you create a face? This way. You know what? Okay. It is what it is. It's level 10. Level 10. I'll be using the lighter shade because it does come with two different shades. One is lighter, one is darker. I'll be using the lighter shade. And this is weird because it's weird because it's a matte, but sometimes it's when it goes on, it's oily. Sometimes it's like thick. Kind of think of coconut oil when it heats up. It gets like thicker, even liquid, not thicker, but more liquidy. Whereas when it's cold, it gets hard. So it's kind of how that is. I guess. That makes sense. I don't know. Do my eyebrows. That's not crazy. We look really good in this mirror. Okay. Yeah, I like my eyebrows thick. Deep up my feelings for you. Watch them grow, perceive devote. This is the seed, light the show. Watch them grow, I dream I know. Deep up my feelings for you. Okay. So next I'm going to, um, Go over the concealer on my face with, or the um, color correct. I'm going to go over with concealer. And I will be using, I'm not going to use this brush. I'll be using a more thicker brush with this. I'm using the same thing that I used for my eyebrows. I'm just going to go and like go over where I did the color correct. Mama upstairs watching Mari. I'm two stories now and I can still hear it. Mm -mm. Shake my head. One thing that I do love about this and um, like Ruby's Kisses and LA Girl Conceal, like stuff like that are really easy to buy. And you know, when you're a student, especially full time, and you're working a part time job. That's a lot more cost effective. Especially when you're not paying any bills. Like, you know, no. Especially 
Yeah. I am not in college yet, so right now I'm not paying any bills except for like gas and stuff like that. I felt like it'd be more effective to buy all like the stuff that I really wanted now before I go to, off to college because I'll have less time to make this money. I'll have less money because full-time college student. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. All right. I probably made absolutely no sense, but let me just put it like this. For me, I found that it is smarter for me to buy like all of my right specific makeup products that I know I'm going to use a lot in the future. It was smarter for me to buy it now. Well, I, I've been doing it over a period of time. It's smarter for me to do it now. I actually have money. And I don't really have anything to pay for. You know, save the rest. All that good stuff. Like save the rest of the money. College. Alright. So next we're going to go into the eyes. They say the eyes. The portals to the soul. Okay, so first I'm going to start with the Urban K eyeshadow primer, the original potion primer, primer potion. Yeah, we're just up all close and personal. Y'all be alright. Oh, this is that type of primer that it dries fast. We gotta um, we gotta blend it in quickly. Don't just wait, cause you'll be upset. So I'm gonna go in my Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette. I promise you, I have been waiting for so long to get this, and it's been sold out. Like many of y'all know, and I finally got it. I freaked out. So I'm gonna go in with this kind of like a transition color. It's orange. It's real gar. This is the brush I usually use for this color specifically for stuff like that. It's from it's a Vivi or whatever. I don't know, it's just like a little nice little brush. And you're gonna put that along the crease. Everything just looks better on this side. Like for some reason, this eyebrow don't never want to come out correctly, but this side of my face, and this eyeball, the color is already brighter over here. I don't know what's up with that. Maybe it has something against. I don't know. Something has something against me, obviously has a problem with me. I don't know what I did, but it is not like me. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry that I hurt you. All right. Next, I'm going to go in with this pretty little color right here. Red Ultra. Red that. I'm going to go with that. Yeah. Like a, like a bright red almost. Using the same brush. I'm going to use like some of my colors with this brush. We got it. The next color, same brush. Venetian red. That one right there. I'm right next to it. Which is a nice little. Not necessarily burgundy, but I don't know. But 
so we're just close. It's a cute little pink. I'm gonna go in using this color right here. It's the shade Primavera. Okay. And I'm gonna put that on the lid, you know? I'm going to do my eyeliner using Wet n Wild's Proline, 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 Proline Felt Tip Eyeliner Black. I love this eyeliner. It's just really poorly constructed. You see, the whole thing just came out. But honestly, this is probably some of the best eyeliner I've ever used so I'm not gonna knock it I'm still gonna buy more and it's inexpensive it also stays on really well I'm going to I'm about to foundation. Yay. Next I will be using the Smashbox Liquid Halo foundation in the shade eight. So next I'm going to go in, start highlighting. So I'll be going in with two different colors of LA Girl Pro Conceal. First one I'll be using is the darker shade and that is in Cool Tan. Then I'm gonna go in with the lighter shade of the two, medium beige, same company, same deal. So next I'm going to um I'm going to set my foundation or set yeah set I'm gonna use I'm gonna set it using the elf face powder So 
I'm about to use is Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. I've hit pan on almost one every single one. Very sad, very depressing. But you know, it's a way of life. So first I'm gonna go in with the lighter shade of my two contours, or the two, the contour two. Go with the lighter shade and I'm gonna use a big brush for that. using this um, bronzing brush from e.l.f. I'm going with the darkest of the colors in the palette. So next I'm going to go in with another loose powder, translucent. I'm going to bra blush. I'm going to do blush. And I will be using Coastal Scents palette. Looks a hot mess now. It's been through. Yeah. It's been through more than I have. But yeah. I'm using that little color. That nice little color right there. Nope, nope. I'm going to use. Sorry. Sorry. I'm going to use the peach color. So I'm going to go into the Beverly Hills, and I can say Beverly Hills Glow Kit, in the shade Sun Dipped, or their little Sun Dip palette. To do that, I'll be using this fan brush from e.l.f. Sorry, yeah, first I will be using shade bronze to start, and then I'll go with the lighter color on top. I gaze in far into the night, I raise my hand. To the fire, but it's no use because you can't stop it from shining through. It's true, baby. Let the light shine through the moonstone because the little ain't popping up for me. And go into our lips to get all done. I will be using this. Is it MK? MK? I don't know. Auto lip liner. Got it from the beauty salon too. It's in shade plum. Highlight the inner corners of my eyes using I don't know, using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Master Palette by Mario, and I'll be using the color Fifth Avenue, that little light color right there, little gold color. And for my lips, I'll be using the Stella 
Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in the shade. Here we go. Well, apparently, I am out of, um, what's it called? Out of setting spray. That's good. So I can't really set my face. But, yeah. Yeah. This is... Thank you for watching my video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on my social networks. And if you have any ideas for my next look, just leave it down below. Thank you. Bye.